Hi, uh, today is uh, Friday, March the 3rd, 2017, it's the third day of Lent, and uh, this is a Sweet Speaks. There is a story about uh, a municipality in Norway, Modum's municipality. Six men from Syria came there. They are given the status of refugees by, by the Norwegian authorities. I have no idea if they really are refugees or if this, this is just a case of welfare migration. So I don't know. But anyway, they have been given, given accommodation by the municipality. They are sharing accommodations. They have their own rooms, but they have to share kitchen, share bathrooms and so on. There is nothing strange about this. A lot of young Norwegians live like this to, to save on housing costs when they study and so on. Because housing is, is expensive in Norway, because it's a high cost country. And they are not happy. So they complained. They want uh, one house each. And uh, what did the municipality do? The refugee service, as I understand, is a part of the welfare authorities in the municipality, told them either you sign the contract or you move out. Isn't this great? I am not sure if this happens in every municipality in Norway. Actually, I doubt it. I think maybe it depends on which municipality it is. But at least this municipality is doing the right thing. Because people born in Norway or Norwegian citizens who, who comes with these demands to the, to the authorities are left out and told that forget that. We'll help you if we can. And sometimes I think the authorities should help people more, sometimes less. Let's not go, get into that right now. But the point is, people who have been paying taxes in Norway don't necessarily get the same, the same help as these people do. And I have nothing against people from Syria. I have nothing against these people either. But I think it's wonderful that they are telling them that beggars can't be choosers, so to speak. And uh, this is something that Sweden could learn from. Send Swedish politicians to Modum and, and, and let them look at how they are doing it there. I think there is a lesson to be learned here. I think this is great. And uh, I suppose that's all I have to say right now. I don't really need to say anything more because I just think it's great. And, uh, and uh, I think that Sweden should look to Norway in this specific case. And Sweden should learn by Norway. Sweden should learn by Modum. So kudos to Modum. And uh, that's all I have to say about this right now. I would like to thank all the people who are supporting this channel through PayPal and through Patreon. I would also like, like to thank the people who are praying for this channel. And if you like this channel, please subscribe so you don't miss anything. Please uh, like my videos if you like them. Please share my videos if, on Facebook or Twitter or whatever. If you got something to say, feel free to comment. I answer any reasonable comments and some of the unreasonable ones too. But sometimes I get a lot of them, so sometimes I miss comments. And anyway, anyway, so this is a tweet speaks. Have a nice day.